Now we're going to drop this paper clip in the water and let's see what happens. Grace's Science Waves! This is Science with the Amazing Grace. Today we're going to do a really fun experiment. You could say it looks like magic, but it really isn't. It's science. Look at this. Doesn't it look like a paper clip? When you mix two metals together, you get an alloy. Alloys can have unique properties, and they can be very interesting, as you will see. <laughs> I have a really fun alloy that can do something amazing. This alloy is called nitinol. It's a mixture of nickel and titanium. It forms a shape memory material. Say that three times fast. <laughs> Did you know alloys can remember? Probably didn't know that before. So it remembers the shape that it was. I'm going to show you why it's called shape memory. Right now, this knit and all is shaped like a paper clip. I'm going to bend it so you can make it any shape you want. Look at how I bent the wire. This looks like a tent, doesn't it? This looks like the roof, and these look like the little poles. You need an adult to help you because it's like hot, 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 hot water. It can burn your fingers. Now we're going to drop this paper clip in the water, and let's see what happens. Oh! Whoa, that changed really fast! Let's try this again. Whoa, that was way too fast. So we used the blow dryer to heat up the nitinol slowly. See how it remembers its original shape? That's really awesome. Whoa, man. It remembers that it was a paper clip. So why is this? The atoms bonded to each other and the nitinol take on two different structures. One is more stable than the other. When we bend it, we change the crystal structure. When we heat it, the atoms vibrate a little. I'm dizzy. And it goes back to the more stable, original state. <laughs> Nitinol remembers what it's supposed to be even if it gets bent down to shape. There's a life lesson in there somewhere. Be like Nitinol. Remember what you're supposed to be even if you get bent down to shape. The shape memory effect was discovered in a gold cadmium alloy by Arnie Olander in the 1930s. This alloy is called Nitinol because it contains nickel and titanium. It was developed at the Naval Ordnance Lab. That's why it's called nitinol. Shape memory materials are used in places where you need metals to keep their shape after use. Some tools are made using these alloys. <laughs> Thanks for watching Science with the Amazing Grace. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up down below and subscribe to my channel and ring the bell real loud so you can see all my fun videos. And remember kids, science is fun! Remember what you're supposed to be even if you get bent out of shape. <laughs>